For 15 seasons, Marriage Boot Camp has saved hundreds of relationships. To move past the blade, you need to identify it. We witness breakthroughs. I love my wife to death. I've done disrespectful and wrong <laughs> You don't want to hurt your other. Revealed shocking secrets. Hazel wanted to know, are you using me for my fame? No. Deception was indicated. Seen dramatic breakups. In this box is a ring, and I'm keeping it. And even sheer makeups. I want you to be with me forever. This season, we're seeing all that and more. I don't want to cry, Doc. And these couples had to deal with lock battle just like everyone else. Stuck in the same room for 13 days. But there's one constant in every season. When the filming stops, the real work begins. So this ain't easy. No, no, it's not. I sat down with five former boot camp couples to see how they were doing since leaving the program and how they have held up during quarantine. This is The Doctor Is It. I'm Dr. Ish Major, a board-certified psychiatrist, and I can tell you firsthand that Marriage Boot Camp is more than just a show. It's real therapy for real cults. So much of our growth is attributed to what we learned in Marriage Boot Camp. So many issues can be the cause of trouble in your relationships, and we tackle some of the toughest. Communication. I, Don't say nothing. Don't I say nothing. To, Just give me a minute. I took my Don't say nothing. Minutes. Give me a minute. Give me a minute. Intimacy. Our romance is, is extinguished. We used to be a five alarm, four alarm blade. And trust. Don't Yo. say nothing Yo. about what we did today. Yo. Keep it a Yo. secret. That just was the breaking point for me. Get ready to take some notes. We had to deal with each other. And we had, with dealing with each other, I feel like we began to see the changes in each other. Because I guarantee you're going to learn some things. Let's drop the beat. Communi communi communication. 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 Communi communication. To be a good communicator, you have to be a good listener. Practice active listening skills and understand your why. You're not in a relationship to be right. You're there to belong. And that happens when you feel seen, heard, and understood by a partner. Now, one couple who learned the importance of good communication was Styles P and Oscar. Communication is super, super key because, you, you you know, you can love but not always be in love. You have to be able to communicate that. Peaks and the valleys, everything. Yeah. Next, we have a critical topic, intimacy. If you think you can be a couple with no intimacy, you better think again. Our next category is unlit. And the winner is Styles P and Azu. He already know. I told you. I know I lack romance, so I have to say it's on me. The secret to intimacy is vulnerability. If they can't see you, they can't accept you. The relationship you have with them is a mirror image of your relationship with yourself. The more you fall in love with your own existence, the more they can fall in love with you. Sharing leads to caring, and that leads to closeness, both emotional and physical. Now, Jocelyn and Ballistic, they are definitely one couple who had zero intimacy issues. Robert, he's like, he just, he's like a, he, he's like a dog. This is my fiance, she's very beautiful. It's not, you know, it's not my fault. And lastly, the one quality every relationship needs, trust. I think the big reason why she can't move past it is she don't know why it happened and she doesn't know how to try to keep it from happening again. I don't even think his mind was even in the marriage. If you go through your relationship looking for the evidence to support your own insecurity, that's all you'll ever find. Trust isn't something your partner has to prove they're worthy of. It's something you have to know you have an abundance of and just give it. Trust in yourself that whatever they do, good, bad, or ugly, you will be okay. Many couples fight through trust issues, but the couple who fought the artist is really each other. I'm in a position now, mentally, man, where I know that my job is really to protect her. You know what I mean? Just like my best friend, like he knows everything. Like we've known each other since I was 17. To deal with me and me to deal with him during all that growth, like that's my homie. So for me, it was more so just trying to find the calmness in myself to be able to deal with whatever will come this way and be able to still protect her. Now, you can learn the tools for survival. Trust the process. Yeah, okay. Trust the process, for sure. <laughs> Each week on The Doctor Is It, I'll ask your favorite couples to dig even deeper. It's been a learning process, man. Well, Shawnee wants me to be more direct. They'll share the secrets to their relationship success. <laughs> For me, I feel like I've been a lot calmer, calmer. I mean, we fought, don't get it twisted. Certain days, I wanted to push you over the balcony, possibly. <laughs> and dish on where they are now. Have you guys set up a new date? Uh, are we getting married? Okay, let me say this. On the next The Doctor Is In, does Ballistic really want to marry Jocelyn? Find out right after an all-new episode of Marriage Bootcamp on WeTV.